rise and shine like the big bright stars you are. Good morning, tubesters. Um, these little vlogs, these little tiny vlogs that I'm recording and uploading via my phone are going to be, um, I'm going to call them vlog bursts. So welcome to another vlog burst. Um, it's just a quick update on the situation to keep you guys reprised of um, what the uh, progress is on the computer and on the channel itself. Thank you guys so much for your patience if you're watching this. You guys are freaking amazing. Um, honestly, I know a lot of YouTubers say they have the best audience in YouTube or the best family in YouTube, but you guys really are the best if you're watching this video because it means that you're sticking with me and I just, I can't be more appreciative of that. Um, I, I, to be honest, it's been really hard to be positive the last couple of days because of all the issues and, and this YouTube channel really makes me feel good to be making it, to be creative again and this, I feel like I've hit this brick wall with the computer trouble that like stops, halts my creativity. I have all these ideas and I can't really do anything with them be, yet because I've hit this wall. You know, I'm still going to keep recording stuff for now but I mean then I'll have a ton of stuff to upload once I get a new computer but I can't edit any of it so it's just so frustrating to not be able to do anything. And um, talking to you guys makes me feel good. Not being able to do a full vlog really bothers me and irks me too. And I'm not gonna record a bunch of vlogs and then upload them all when I get a computer. That just would suck. It would give you guys so much crap to sift through to get to anything meaningful. So um, I just wanted to thank you guys again for watching and, and just letting you know where my head's at. Um, I am trying to stay positive. I am trying to focus on the vision board and focus on the goal, which is of course the MacBook Pro. Um, I decided to go with the MacBook Pro. I don't want to go with the PC because if I do go with a PC, I'll have to relearn how to use it because I'm on Windows 7 right now. The new PC would be Windows 8, which I would have to relearn how to use because I absolutely hate it. I've, I've avoided it like the plague. And then as soon as I learn Windows 8, Windows 10 is going to get released, which is kind of like the bastard child of Windows 7 and Windows 8. It's like a, a merging of the two, which I hate all the features of Windows 8, so I don't know why they're doing that, but whatever. It is, it's Microsoft's choice. But So I'm going to have to learn two OSs, two new OSs, new to me anyway, if I get a, another PC, and I don't want to do that. I really don't want to do that. Yeah, they're more affordable, but I'd rather go... Go big or go home, you know, get the best machine that I can, the most consistent machine that I can with the best support and the best hardware and everything so that I can give you guys the best channel that I can possibly give, um, you know, without like extra cameras and stuff. So for now, I can give you guys the best channel that I can possibly give. And besides, if I buy a Mac, that'll be like the only computer that I'll need to buy in like five years. Whereas if I buy a PC, I'm going to have to upgrade the damn thing every year. That's just how they are. I'll have to replace it so um, I did find a relatively affordable option for a MacBook um, I just have to wait for my paycheck see how much my paycheck's going to be and uh, I've got a few other little things that some extra money sitting here and there that I can kind of merge together and combine with my paycheck to get one so I'll keep you guys apprised of that um, yeah and then after I get the MacBook I'm going to be sharing with you guys how I got it because it's a little hidden way of getting an affordable MacBook Pro, a new, you know, model MacBook Pro without having to go to a pawn shop or Craigslist or a refurbished shop or whatever, you know. Um, so I'm going to share that with you guys once I get it too. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for continuing to tube in and show your support. You guys are amazing. You, I mean, though you don't give us a whole lot of thumbs up or comments, I know you're there at least from the view count and that's what matters. And I love you guys. Thank you so much.